turning a dry, empty ditch into a cooling escape. Who's on board to help and what you can do to jump in? Wouldn't it be nice to take a dip in the pool on a hot day like today? Sure would, but if you live in Beardstown, you know all too well you can't after the community's only pool closed two years ago. Now a local company is taking the plunge, trying to get other donors to dive in too. ABC News Channel 20's Kimberly Howard reports from Cass County. Believe it or not, this dry sandy ditch was once filled with water, a place kids could learn to swim and people could cool off. There's now no such place in Beardstown, but that could change now that a local company is jumping in. <laughs> Lots of splashing, laughing, learning how to dive off the diving board. It's a time many remember well, a time when Beardstown had a community pool. I was on the swim team when I was younger and then eventually did the lifeguard thing. Then my kids grew up here, so they went to the swimming lessons. Which in Beardstown is a must. Well, we're Rivertown, obviously. And when there's no pool, there are problems. And because we had so many drownings from the people swimming in the river on Illinois here. The Beardstown Park District built the pool in 1957, more than five decades of summer fun. Unfortunately, it's a big concrete pool that had a lot of structural problems and it came to a point where it kind of passed inspection. It closed in 2011, was ripped from the ground, leaving behind only dirt and memories. I was very sad and very upset because that's been a big part of our community for ever since I can remember. The Park District never stopped trying to build a new pool. They're crossing their fingers for state grants, but so far they're only handling private donations. You know, among ourselves, trying to fundraise from individuals, school children, to service clubs. They've scrounged together about $30,000, a far cry from the $2.5 million needed until the town's largest employer offered a deal, doubling any offer up to $115,000. So if you know if one person gives a dollar, that's two dollars. So it really is a 50% return on your on your money. 230,000 if they reach their goal. Yeah, that's pretty happy news. Our workers, their families to enjoy, to want to be here. I really want to see this go. I really really this is a big program and come on people, we need it. And if you want to help Beardstown create a new community pool, Cargill will be matching those dollars through October 1st of 2014. In Beardstown, Kimberly Howard, ABC News Channel 20. Donations for the Beardstown Community Pool are being accepted at the Beardstown Park District Office, Beardstown Savings Bank, First National Bank of Beardstown, and West Central Bank, of course, in Beardstown.